Hi and welcome to a new video. Is your iPhone stuck on the charging screen and won't turn on? When the iPhone battery dies, it will show an empty red battery icon with a cable. In this video, I will show you multiple troubleshooting methods to get you out of the screen. Let's go! There are two possible reasons why this problem may have occurred. It's either a software glitch or a hardware malfunction. One reason for this is probably because you are not using an original battery on your iPhone. Genuine batteries are built to work with iOS properly, including reporting charge levels and battery health. It's also possible that you haven't charged your iPhone for a long time. If that's not the problem, then cleaning your charging port can be a good start to resolve this issue. There could be dust inside that is causing your charger to malfunction. You can carefully use a toothpick or any other non-metal material to clean your port. If that did not work, then the next thing you should do is to make sure that the accessories you are using are still in good working condition. You can try replacing the adapter to see if that fixes the problem. Then do the same thing with the cable. Also, try connecting to another Apple device because this way you'll be able to identify if your cable or adapter is the cause of the problem. In case your iPhone is still experiencing problems, then you should charge it for at least an hour. Another possible solution is to use a hairdryer to heat up the back of your device while it is charging. When you give this a try, be careful not to overheat it to prevent any internal damage on your iPhone. Your battery will heat up when you blow hot air over the back of the phone. This causes an increase in battery voltage which helps your iPhone to boot up. If you've tried solving those hardware issues and your battery is still not fixed, then it might be a software problem. Another option for resolving this problem is to install a repair tool on your computer. For this, I recommend Tenorshare Reboot, which addresses nearly all software issues on your iPhone. This method is quite practical because it will also immediately update your iPhone to the most recent iOS version in addition to fixing any software glitches. Aside from that, it also works both on Mac and Windows PC. However, please note that most of its features require a paid subscription. If you want to try and test it out, you can download the software by clicking on the tag at the top right corner or find the link in the description below. Upon installation, launch Reboot on your computer and click the Start button. Next, click on Standard Repair. The program will then automatically provide the latest firmware that is compatible with your device. After that, follow the on-screen instructions to complete the repair process. When the repair is finished, your iPhone will automatically reboot and the problem should now be resolved. Now, plug in your iPhone to the computer using an original or an MFI certified lightning cable to ensure no conflict on the transfer of data. But if your iPhone is still stuck in the charging screen after trying all the steps, then the problem might be hardware related. In that case, the most effective course of action may be to completely replace your battery. For this, it will be preferable to visit an authorized Apple store to ensure that your iPhone will be provided with an original battery. And that's it! If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye.